Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm working on something a little bit different that I've never done before. This is a traveling snail mail book that my pen pal Lily created. So if you're not sure what that is, it's basically a book that goes around to uh, a few different ladies and each girl gets to make a page in the book that basically portrays who you are and your crafting style, it tells a little bit about yourself, um, so she can remember her pen pals forever and she suggested you put a picture so she can keep that and um as well as some facts about you and i think this is a really really cool idea it's really really nice to have um this little memory book of your pen pals i think that's really really nice to keep forever so i'm just using most of my favorite things right now i'm using uh papers that's me by the way <laughs> I'm just using papers from the Ooh La La paper pad from Michaels and both of those papers are from there and then I added that organza on top that is from Hobby Lobby. It just has like gold glitter polka dots which I've been loving lately. Um, you guys will probably see that soon in a few videos that I have coming up. Um, I actually have them uploaded and ready to go. I'm just waiting for my friends to receive their mail so I can post it. But you will see in several different videos that I used a lot of these things that I use in this page. Um, for example, this floral piece, I've been using that a lot lately. I actually have to buy more of the confetti chipboard because I've been using it like crazy. I've been using it on everything. I'm just so in love with this collection right now. So I definitely have to go and buy out some more before they vanish from the face of the earth forever because we all know that's bound to happen and then i'll never find it again so i definitely have to make a purchase at joanne's or something anyways i'm rambling so i just matted my picture on that pink paper that was actually just a scrap i had next to me and it worked out pretty good because it matches the pink and the florals and then i added that cute clip that my friend uh, kathy sent to me thank you so much kathy um, that is from a Maggie Holmes collection as well. And then I added that little bird, which I've been loving lately. And he is also from the Maggie Holmes confetti chipboard. Now I'm just uh, putting my name with some gold thickers. The, these are from Dear Lizzie, and I buy these on Michaels. They're like $5, but you can always use a coupon. And I'm just placing them down now, but I do end up going back and adding hot glue just to make sure they stick. Because I don't trust thickers at all. <laughs> they always fall and I can't I can't I can't deal with it. <laughs> I hate when you buy thickers and they're all like messed up in the packaging. Like that makes me not even want to use them. Uh anyways, I'm rambling. So now I'm doing another one of my favorite things lately, which is um making a little ring full of like different trims and ribbons. So, this is just like a little uh, ring that I found in the jewelry section. It comes in a pack of um, several different ones, different sizes. And it's just like a little gold ring, which you can just uh, hook onto anything, which I've been loving. So, I just mixed up a bunch of trims and made a little uh, tassel looking thing. So, now I'm just going to put that right onto the... Uh, pink paper behind my picture and I really like how that looks I've been loving doing this lately and you guys will see soon in future videos that I've been doing this a lot and the pearls are a little bit challenging to stay because of you know the beads but uh, I just added some hot glue and um, yeah that works <laughs> so I'm almost done um, I didn't have to add much because it's only a 6x6 six six paper, but I do love how it turned out so much because I just used most of my favorite pieces, like I said. So I really do think this is <laughs> the perfect summary of my crafty style, Super Maggie Holmes, uh, pink and blue, and... <laughs> um yeah just cute and then i of course added that gold bow you know guys know i love that gold bow from hobby lobby and i added on to everything 
Okay, so now to go next to my page, I chose this shaker that I had previously made and I will also have a video on that pretty soon. It's just a vellum shaker and uh, I love how that came out because I did like a little glue glitter technique, super cute, and then I like stuck shells into it so the shells kind of stand up. Uh, well, they're like glitter sequin shells, they're not like real shells. But oh my goodness, I love how they, those shakers turned out. I will show you guys soon in an upcoming video. So now I'm just writing some facts about me behind my picture. And I'm pretty much done. And I so love how this turned out. Um, I think it is so me. And it portrays exactly what I love right now. Um, and my crafting style. So yeah. That is it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. Make sure you go subscribe to Lily if you're not already. So you can see the final book. She will be flipping through every single page if you want to see. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!